Hey everybody, it's been a while since we've been before this wall and I'm here for a reason. As a parent, this drives me crazy. Uh, today is another episode of This Is Why We Carry. And the series is brought to us by the United States Concealed Carry Association. The USCCA will help you get ready for what happens before, during, and after an act of armed self-defense. And it doesn't have to be with a gun. All you have to do is become a member. It's uscca.com slash gng. There's a lot of education and training. If you want to even become a firearms instructor through them, you can. Check them out. Link is in the description and in the pinned comment. It might be the most important link you ever hit. This series of videos I bring forward to make people realize that there are more lives saved with defensive uses of firearms than the anti-gunners will ever acknowledge. There is a reason why people arm themselves. It's because when seconds count, help is minutes away. And when it comes down to your life flashing before your eyes, you don't have minutes. You have to take action. We're going to go down to Harris County or Houston, Texas, when uh, midnight on Sunday night slash Monday morning, a uh, husband and wife with their two infants in the back of their sport utility vehicle pulled up into the driveway of their home, again, just after midnight. Uh, the father noticed that somebody had opened up their back door, and he immediately uh, engaged the two subjects and shot them both. Now, once the husband engaged, the mother, the wife, uh, instinctively took off. She left the scene uh, to create distance between the attackers and her family. Uh, the, uh, nobody was hurt in the family, uh, on the family side, the husband, wife, nor the two children in the back. In fact, the father potentially saved their lives as these two carjackers thought that they had an easy target, again, just after midnight on uh, Sunday night into Monday morning. Now, the two wannabe tough guys, the two wannabe thugs were brought to the hospital and uh, the sheriffs are investigating. And according to the sheriff's office, they are in uh, fair condition. Uh, more information will come out as the investigation unfolds, but it appears as though that the father acted appropriately and quickly and immediately when it was time to save the lives of his family. Remember, two infant children in the back seat just, just after midnight and someone's carjacking them. Um, this is one of the reasons I say in every single video to be safe and to stay vigilant and to always carry a gun. We don't do this because we're looking to intimidate people. We don't do this because we have some inferiority complex like some people in the comments might say. We do this because when seconds count, only you are, uh, are, are there. You're, you're the only person who can take your own safety paramount and protect yourself when evil is looking you in the eye if that father never acted who knows what would have happened if those babies would have been hurt if the family would have been hurt uh, but because we have the right to defend ourselves a right that is given to us by our creator not by the government this husband wife and their two children are definitely going to live to see another day and are unharmed in this incident let me know what you think down below. I think fantastic job by the father defending his family. Fantastic job by the mother in creating distance. And uh, let me know what you think down below. Love to hear what you have to say. Some people might think different. But I know, I'll tell you one thing. You break into my car at, uh, after midnight in my driveway and my kids are in the back. Y'all be safe. Stay vigilant and carry a gun to keep you, your friends, your family, your community safe. I'll see you on the next one. Take care.